A morning snack for students at Kilohana Preschool went horribly wrong when they were mistakenly served pine sole instead of apple juice. Health officials say the cleaning liquid was properly labeled, so parents are still baffled as to why it happened. Manola Morales has more on tonight's top story. Manola? Officials here at the preschool did not want to comment about what happened, but the pastor tells me that the classroom assistant who served the drinks no longer works here. According to a report by the State Department of Health, the classroom assistant poured the yellow-brown liquid into cups from a container that was in a cleanup cart in the kitchen. It was a pine salt container that was properly labeled, and yet cups were brought in and served to the children. Are you worried about your yes, son? Yes, of course, of course, I worry about son. Paramedics were called in to evaluate three girls ages four and five. EMS says they believe the children had drank a little bit of the liquid, but they were unharmed and did not need any treatment. Parents are still in disbelief. While the two products are similar in color, they smell distinctly different. I think it's extremely terrifying. It's very, very scary. But it's hard for me or any of the people that I've spoken to to understand how it happened in the first place. Parents say the school sent an email out to let them know what happened, and a meeting was also held Thursday night to answer their questions. While it's still not clear how the mistake was made, since the assistant no longer works there, some parents tell us that the school has taken all the necessary precautions. I personally believe that this could have happened anywhere, that an individual who was compromised in some way, um, they could have made this error in any place. Like other places that serve food, the school cafeteria is inspected and given a green placard if it passes. The OH says inspectors were sent after the incident and saw that cleaning materials were separated from food items, so the school passed inspection. Manola Morales, KHON, 2 News.